Ultimately, you start out on a small label and you have to go to a big one in order to make any real impact. Well, you have to, in a certain sense, to borrow the money off of them to have enough money to go out and tour, to go out and hire the PA, to, to, to pay for the hotel. You know, and it's all borrowed money. I mean, if you don't do any good, you don't get no money. But if you're doing all right, I mean, if you're selling records, then you're paying back the, the money you borrowed in the first place. Yeah. Whereas on Step Forward, they could never lend us £2,000 to go out and do a tour. Yeah. Whereas so Polydor could lend us How's it going to end up, though? I mean, are you going to end up living in uh, Los Angeles no alongside Rod Stewart? No way. I mean, how's it, how's it going to end up, though? What do you, how do you see Sham 69 it ends up. What it ends up is, as soon as I'm not happy anymore about what I'm doing, then I just jack it in. Yeah, but they all say that, though, don't they, Jim? I'll do be they honest. all say that? Well, of course they I do. I don't know that about it, John. I mean, well, I'm, only, I'm only speaking about myself. No, I know, but I mean, how, 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 do you, how do you really think? I mean, if you go on being a successful is like as you The point now. is like this. The punk was dying until Sham 69 came along. Sham 69 came along and give life to punk. We give life to a lot of kids, right? We, get, we, we said to them, right, punk is not dead. Everybody was saying punk is dead. It's in the graveyard. They've got yeah. one foot in the grave. We said, no, it's not got one, one foot in the grave. You've only got to look now. You've got Jilted John on top of the pops. Yeah. You've got Susie Ban Susie and the Banshees being played on Radio 1. You've got the Lurkers on top of the pops. Yeah, They're all being given a chance now. Yeah. Whereas if Sham 69 hadn't said, right, we want to go on top of the pops to, to prove that you're not going to sweep us under the carpet, you're not going to destroy us, it's far better going on top of the pops and an old lady saying, oh, what's that? You know, they go like, you know, get him off. You're not watching him. And the little kids say, yeah, I want to watch him. You know, don't you switch it off. Then go on and say a program like Revolver, stuck at 11.15 at night. If you go on top of the pops and there's kids from 10, right, to 15, that can't get in the gigs, can see it. But 11.15 on Revolver, they're not going to be able to see you because their mums are going to say, come on, son, Off to bed. bedtime now. You know, or they're down the discotheques. Ah.